Hey, what's up? Anime Magician here, and well, as you all know, the coronavirus is going on. All of us are quarantined or locked up at home. Uh, conventions have been postponed or have been canceled. So that's fun to know. And also, there has been a lot of people complaining that they don't want to stay at home. But it doesn't have to be uh, boring at home all day because there is one thing you can do at home, and that is play some games and watch some good old anime. And today, what I'm going to do, I'm going to tell you at least a few animes that you can watch that you can watch at home or you can watch in your phone. As long as you have internet, you should be good. As long as you don't have that 3G internet. And before I start this video, just a quick note that I'm not going to include any super popular anime such as Jojo Bizarre's Adventure, My Hero Academia, or any of those big animes because I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do in this list, I'm actually just gonna give you any animes that at least up to around 50 episodes. So, at least give you enough time to watch not just one anime but more than one, but at least like three or four consecutively. And so today, what the first anime that we're gonna start off with is an anime that it is high school based and that is... Haven't you heard? I'm Sakamoto. And if you haven't heard about this anime, well, you're in for a ride. So it's basically about how this uh, student that went into this high school ha is literally the most perfect uh, student ever. He attracts girls and all that sort of stuff. And he is perfect in every way. He executes everything perfectly. However, there are some guys that don't like him at all. Some girls that want to trap him. And they basically want to make him look dumb or stupid in a way. And he counters all this kind of stuff by countering everything majestically and perfectly. And yeah, this anime is quite hilarious if you watch it and you see all these events that are going on. And it's funny how he connects himself with other um, characters in his own weird and unique way. Which was actually one of the reasons why I put this anime in this list. And it is around 12 episodes, so it is a good sized anime. Then next up, we have an anime that also is weird in its own way and it's much more weird than the one that we first talked about and it's a high school anime and this anime is Aochan Can Study and oh boy is this a special one. So this anime is basically about how uh, this girl that basically is in high school wants to is basically studying a lot and wants to get away from her father which then a boy comes up to her and wants to confess to her that she he actually likes her. However, the thing with Aochan is that she has the most erotic thoughts ever. Like she thinks of the most erotic things that you can think of and actually sometimes may happen. And it is quite funny and I'm actually quite wonder why she keeps thinking about this at first. And it mostly has to do with her father which is one of the reasons that she wants to move away from him. It's because he is an erotic author. Now I wonder if my parents were to be an erotic author. Nope, never mind. I'm not touching that. But yeah, this anime, it is fun and it can get a little bit edgy. So mind that. And it is around 12 episodes. So it is a really good size anime to watch. And then next up, we have another anime that it is completely different from the other two. And I mean like turning the tables from nice or happy to really gory stuff. And if you're into gory anime, then today's your luck. So today, this anime that I'm gonna talk about is this anime called Helsing Ultimate, which is an OVA version of the original Helsing anime. And it's basically about a vampire named Alucard, who basically uh, is owned by this lady called Sir Integra, which she runs an organization that basically hunts vampires or anything evil in a way. And it can get a little bit controversial due to it's a few references in, within the anime, but it is well worth your time. There is a lot of blood, a lot of action-packed scenes, and quite a lot of mystery as well, which I quite enjoy this anime. I actually like the main character Alucard a lot, how he reacts to everything and how he takes uh, everything quite a bit serious as well. And also, I also like their um, abridged versions they have of this anime, which is from Team 4 Star, which I'll link it in the descriptions down below because they're super funny as well. But yeah, go definitely check out this anime if you're into that gory dark stuff. And this anime is 10 episodes, so yeah, it's pretty short, but it's good. And it's 
gory fashion. Then another anime that I can recommend that you can watch as well if you're into fantasy and you're into sci-fi and modern day, then you're probably gonna like this anime. This anime is called Recreators, which is basically anime coming over to another anime in a way. So basically the anime is about how basically whenever someone creates a light novel, a manga, or an anime or a video game, they basically create a world without them knowing. And this it takes in modern time. And the thing is that these characters from those worlds are jumping over to the real world basically. And this uh, high school student gets stuck in the middle of all this. And also he basically has some relationship with the character that's trying to kill him and the other characters that he's helping out as well which I personally did enjoy watching this anime how we dive into his past and how they're trying to figure out who this character that just appeared that's trying to uh, attack them uh, came from and which anime they came from or which reference or whatever they came from and he has to deal with things from his past so that's something that I really enjoyed watching watching did I just say watching? Damn, my spelling it must be messed up today. But yeah, this anime, it is pretty entertaining seeing how different animes and how we have a few references from a few animes that you probably have watched before. And yes, I highly recommend this anime and it is around 12 episodes, so it's not a bad anime. And then for the next and my last one, I know I said I wouldn't include any popular animes, but this one was the shortest one that I could find that it was at least really good actually. And this anime is called Kill la Kill, which is basically about this girl who basically her father died and goes to this academy to find answers. And the thing about this academy, they use uh, this special kind of threats in their students, in their clothing, so they can make them stronger. And the, the thing is, she gets beat up at the first day, and then when she crawls back all the way to her father's uh, house, where it was all burned up and destroyed, she then encounters in their basement a kamui, or basically a piece of clothing that made her strong and powerful and also turns to a bikini for some unknown reason and this anime was just so entertaining seeing how this character uh, not only makes connections with different uh, characters from the anime make but also makes friends and also how she basically tries to figure out how her father died and who killed her father and also is trying to protect her friends as well as long as she's um, looking for the answers to what's going on around this anime and it's pretty good I like I love the animations it's been very entertaining to watch I personally recommend this anime because my gosh it's good not just because of its etchy scenes but also because it's pretty good in or all the aspects which I personally recommend this anime and as I said this before also watch this anime because I personally enjoyed it and if this anime it is around I believe 50 episodes let me check real quick Oh no, never mind, it's 24 episodes. This is actually uh, less than half what I said. So, yeah, that's that. And before I end this video, what animes are you watching in the middle of all this coronavirus and all this epidemic and quarantine? Which you can comment down below so I can then check it out after this video. So, thank you guys for watching. Hit that like, subscribe for more anime content. Follow me on Twitter, on Instagram, as at anime underscore magician. Keep enjoying anime. Stay safe, wash your hands. Don't touch anything that maybe other people have to touch because that's how the coronavirus spreads through coughing or touching something that another person might be contaminated with. Stay safe and see you on the next one. Bye!